Hi everyone, welcome to Girls for STEM. Remember, we are here to encourage girls to pursue STEM. What is STEM? STEM simply means science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. Today, we are going to see how we can ignite a young mind think scientifically. Remember, it's one of the components for encouraging girls to pursue STEM. We have to start asking those questions difficult questions to make their minds start thinking. So today we have a privilege to be talking to Malaika. Malaika is four years old from Zambia and she'll just be studying her kindergarten. Thank you. Enjoy. My name is Kesten Malama Malaika. I'm an engineer for the aerospace company and I'm a lady, I'm a girl, lady, just like you. So I just want to encourage you to start doing science classes so you can also do STEM in future. So I'm going to ask you a few questions, Laika. Um, so the first question is going to be, what is the tallest animal in the world? Do you know it, the tallest? Giraffe. Oh, there you go, a giraffe. Good, excellent. So I'm going to ask another question. What, what do bees, you know bees, the bees, what do they use to make honey? What do you think they use to make honey? Food. Food, yes, but where does it get the food from, the bees? It gets from maize. From that's good. You know what? Maize have got pollen. You know the maize, they've got that flower thing on top when it's growing? Yes. So the bee go... Yellow. Yes. The bee go get that yellow thing. It's called pollen. And then it goes and makes, you know, it's honey. That's very good. So the next question is going to be, do you know what kind of air human beings breathe? Because you are breathing right there. What do they breathe in? What's the name of the of the air that they breathe in? Oxygen. Oh my God! Excellent. Okay. What kind of uh, what do you, what else do you want us to talk about? What 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 do you want us to talk about? Anything? Tell me. About flowers. About flowers. Okay. Um, what type of flowers do you like? Pink and white and yellow you love colors i can see that that's really and really nice purple. oh my I god purple. and i think your shirt has some paper that's nice what? Oh. huh and, and red and yes your top also has red that's nice okay laika one more question few red. more questions so red. do you red, know red, red, red. all right in maroon and black. Oh, you know so many colors. That's so nice. Nice. Okay, so let's do something else. Um, do you know how far United States is? No. How far? Okay, do you think it's closer to Africa or it's... How, how far is it, United States of America? Far. It's far? How do you get there? Do you know how to get there? How do people get there? They get there with an aeroplane. Ooh, what's an aeroplane? And jet. Wow, but what is an aeroplane? What, what is a jet? A jet is an aeroplane. It's an aeroplane? What does it do? I want you to explain what is it. Explain what is it? What is it? It flies in the air and the sky. Oh my, how does it fly? People drive it. How do they drive it? Do they put, what do they put inside the, the plane so that it can fly? What do you think? Chairs. Yes. What People else? People inside. Okay. People what inside. Yes. What about what makes it to fly? What do you think? What makes it to fly? What makes it? You know what, make, mommy, what makes it to fly? No, I want you to tell me, not your mom. Look at me. What makes it to fly? What do you think? 
a thing for driving. Yes, you are right. But they they put something in there. What about a car? How does the car drive? How that does that drive from Chipata to Lusaka? What does he put in the car for it to drive? He puts a chair. Uh huh. A clock inside. Yes. And uh, a, a driving me. Yes. Uh huh. You. And, uh, no asking, no asking anybody. Tell me, talk to me. Uh huh. You are very right. What else? But he goes somewhere to put something in the car before it moves. And wait. Yes. And he put the boots. Uh huh. But he put he something. Put the... He puts something before he drives the car. He put. He goes pays money. What is that thing? He used the keys. Yeah, but besides the keys, he has to put something in the car so that it can drive. Like money. Not money. He goes at the gas station. What does he put at the gas station when he goes there? What does he put in the car? Money. He puts fuel. He puts gas, oh. you know? Yes, the car won't drive without the gas, you know that? Yes. Well, with fuel. Yes, okay, now let's do this. How about a plane? How does it fly? What does it use to fly? It does, it, it, it has things for like this. They are wings. They are wings. They are called wings. And it flies very in the air. Yes, yes, it does. That's really nice. So the plane also uses fuel, Laika. You did you know that? The airplane. Yes. Are you surprised? No. Yes. Yeah. You're surprised, right? Why are you surprised? I thought the open doesn't use fuel. You thought it uses what? I thought it does fly nicely. I know it does, but it has to use fuel too. Too? No, I mean it has to use fuel. It has to use fuel as well, just like a car. The Airplane also uses fuel. Okay, so now let's talk about something else, Laika. Let me ask this. Would you live in space? You would live in space? Mm -mm. Why? I would just live in, in just our world. Which one? Chipata. You suppose you went to space, what would happen? You can fall down up to down. Yes, but you know that some people live in space right now? How did you know that? It's because my, my friend said that some people, they live in space. Yeah, it's nice. You think you can, you want to live there one day or you, do you want to go there one day? Uh, I'm scared. Everybody's scared, but it's safe. Some people live there. So one day I'll show you those people that are living there so you know it's not scary. Anything? <laughs> 